Hello, dears. Welcome to Beauty for Heart. I'm Lily, as an Today, I will be sharing with you this. This is the Kobe Beauty Liquid Matte Lipstick. Wow! I was watching a Singapore beauty YouTuber, Tiara, for her review for this. She was given the PR set from this company and she was obviously giving a review. And so coincidentally, on the same day, a subscriber of mine requested me to do a beauty review for these lipsticks. So I bought this all by my own pocket and have been using it over a month. So now, I think it's a good time to share with you my experience. I'm sorry dears, I've been away for quite some time, about 3 to 4 weeks. I haven't been feeling myself lately and don't really wish to face the camera. So I'm back, slowly building up my pace, so pardon me for my absence. Coming back to this, I'll be doing the review first, then the swatches including the hand swatches as well as the lip swatches and a conclusion whether this is worthy to buy. So, let's get started! Review time! This was delivered to my doorsteps in about less than a week. With the outer packaging like this, then when you open up, there is obviously a tissue, and then the individual lipstick boxes which is a good idea and I find that they are very thoughtful because you can put the lipstick in and give it as a gift to your friends or relative or whoever you want to give. And each individual lipstick box contains these color stickers with their name and also brand name and the ingredients list. I bought a set of 6 because I want to try out the color and do a review. They only have 6 lipsticks right now. And when you buy a set of 6, it will come with this very classic white glossy cardboard box with the logo over here in black and a string for you to pull. And there it is. The six liquid lipstick sitting on the bed or lying on the bed. So each of the lipstick comes in this hexagon shape so that when you place on the table, it wouldn't roll around, dropping on the floor and everywhere that you cannot find. I always have this problem. I always drop my things and it will roll under my bed, which is sometimes very difficult to retrieve it out. So it comes in like this, uh, an acrylic transparent tube. And you can see the lipstick color straight away. And, and the cap is rose gold. And the logo over here is also rose gold. Comes with a standard doe foot applicator like this. And it doesn't have any scent. So it will not be irritating. Kobe Beauty, as I mentioned just now, is a new Singapore brand. They are born to break boundaries. And they claim that all these colors are designed for all skin types and also for all skin tone. And they claim that they are cruelty free although there isn't any bunny logo on the box or on the tube. They claim that they will never support and permit animal testing and they will only select supplier with the same rules. Pricing for this is $22 sing dollar each which is about 16 USD. Consider a very average price for a liquid lipstick. And when you buy a set of 6, is 132 sing dollar which actually there isn't any bundle deal so there is no discount when you buy a set it's totally up to you you need not buy a set but because i'm doing a review that's why i buy one set otherwise you can just choose one or two of your favorite color and then just pay for the shipping cost and currently i can only find this brand through the internet and didn't see them selling in the physical store so dears, if you are happy in Singapore and you see this in the physical store, please inform me and share with me in the comment section below. Yeah, thank you so much. The company claims that this flags on like a lip gloss and coats like a lipstick and feels like nothing else. For my experience, it takes about 1-2 to two minutes to dry up and after drying up, it's not sticky at all. Like this. And true enough, this is very very lightweight throughout the day. I can't feel anything on my lips. And 
actually if you just have been following me for quite some time then you will know that actually I don't really like to wear liquid matte lipsticks because I've naturally dry lips so I prefer actually very rich creamy lipsticks rather than this kind of liquid matte lipstick but surprisingly for this lipsticks it doesn't dry up further of course being the nature of a liquid matte lipstick and my naturally dry lips my lines my lip lines can be seen quite obviously but it doesn't worsen it so if you dears have similar lip concern like mine having deep lines yeah i call it the ama lips the grandmother lips because it's really very wrinkly then maybe you would like to exfoliate your lip first apply lip balm then tap off the excess lip balm before you apply this lipstick that's what i do it doesn't dry my lips further and my lips feel very comfortable i did this silky girl liquid matte lipsticks review before about two years ago i mentioned that this is lightweight and feel comfortable but now with this kubi liquid matte lipstick it feels more comfortable and also lighter weight i really don't feel anything on the lips so i know sometimes you dears do not like to wear lipsticks or lip gloss because you feel sticky and heavy on the lips and that irritates you then you may want to consider having a lightweight lipstick it's much resistance and it's also transfer proof for the longevity i've applied it many times with and without lip balm basically without touching the lips it will stay throughout the whole day but being the nature of a liquid lipstick once you have oily food or emollient stuff like maybe cream of mushroom deep fried stuff stir fried vegetables you can wipe this off with a tissue and the lipstick will be gone for the colors available i will share more in details when i do the swatches and in the meantime although kubi mentioned that they created all these colors to suit all skin tones i find that this is still very much depends on individual skin tones colors like this this is taupe color let's talk about it it doesn't suit my skin tone okay i will say usually i will avoid purplish color on the lips because i will look dead or being poisoned but when i was wearing this with a naked face i expect myself to look very sick poisoned dead with this color but surprisingly it's not so dead it's still dead but not so dead if you know what i mean so apart from this top color i think that the rest of the color can suit a lot of skin tones and now let's proceed to the swatches and see the colors and let me start off with this color this is walk up like this This is a natural pink nude color suitable for everyday use and this is my favorite color among the 6 of them. For Sital as well, I can use it for any occasion. And this is the second color, Rose Dose. Although the name is Rose Dose, I find that the colour is more of the terracotta rosy colour More terracotta than rose And this is my second favourite colour You can also use it for everyday use To the office, to play, for party and gather with friends And this is let's talk about it if this is a top color, usually I will avoid this color totally because it's very purplish and makes me look very sick or deep. Mm, not really liking this color. It would be great for dears with fairy skin and with a blue base tone skin. This is very good, it's berry colour. This is a very beautiful berry colour suitable for the evening use. If you have dinner, dinner and dance, yeah, this is very beautiful.
and it is ready or not. It is ready or not is a red, red color. I do not know why in the camera it appears dark, but in real life, this is actually bright red. This is a universal color suitable for lots of skin tone and also it helps to whiten the teeth and give you a very energetic look. Problem with removing red lipsticks. Become an instant clown. Fight me! This is a blue ray. Green eyes with red lips reminds me of Christmas. <laughs> okay, this I don't know why the camera is seen so much darker. Both red seem so much darker in the camera, but not so in real life. And this red also makes the teeth look whiter. Conclusion, is it worth buying? For $22, it has 4.2 ml. I think this is really worth it. It's $22 is a very typical price for liquid lipsticks. The quality is comparable to this. This is the Fenty Beauty Lip Paint. This has only 4 ml ml. I've forgotten the price. I think it's more expensive than this Kobe Beauty. If you dears are adventurous and always want to test out new stuff, new items, new products, and like to support indie brand, uh, actually I'm not so sure whether they are indie brand, but they are new brand. So you might like to test them out for their quality and as well as the colors. The colors are very beautiful, even including the taupe color, which I don't really like it because purple, greyish purple lipsticks on my skin tone looks terrible. And yes, for Tiara who is the local, the Singapore beauty YouTuber, if you use her code, which I will find her code and link it in the description box below later, you will enjoy a 10% discount. So I think if you want to test out maybe one or two, especially if you are living in Singapore, you can always use a code and make it more worthwhile. Yeah, I bought mine with a coat. Alright, that's all for the sharing today. Actually, dears, do you have any other lipsticks? A new brand, rich, creamy lipsticks to suggest? I like to try that out. I know Jacqueline Hill just launched her lipsticks range, but again, she always have a lot of drama with her launches. I don't know why. So if you know of any rich creamy lipsticks for me to test out or you want me to test out any other new brands, Singapore brand or cruelty free brands, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much. Also, thank you so much for staying with me although I've been missing for about 3 weeks. So yes, last but not least, here's a new beauty tip for us to be more beautiful and more wise. Don't run away from your problems when your mind is filled with goodness, a bright future lies ahead. Thank you so much for watching again. If you like this video, please help me to like, comment, subscribe and click the bell notification button below. Thank you so much and may you dears have a peaceful, blissful and joyful week ahead. See you next time. Bye!